game. Unfortunately, our weather forecast is somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It'll certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces hoping it will all somehow stay away, but I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena absolutely picture perfect for a game of this nature so off we go then Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Isco. He's the one with the magic feet, Peter. He's the kind of player who can change a game with a single touch, unlocking a defence or, or creating space to get a shot away. I'm assuming that he's been tasked with being the creator-in-chief here, and you can see him picking out runners and, and setting up people in that final third. Up to meet it! He didn't well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases the chances of the ball being met like that by someone. made sure that that won't get through Saul Sergio Ramos Saul Rodrigo and here's Morata Spain have had plenty of possession, but few, if any, genuine chances. Leads it over to the other flank. Sergio Ramos gets it back. Puki really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. And here's Rodrigo. Hit into the middle, and he's cut it out. It's Thiago. He hits it. He's found his man. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. And it's played forward. Thiago. Well played, he saw that coming. Forward it goes. Now it's Rodrigo. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Heading towards half time, and it is still scoreless. A little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. What an adventurous run from a defender. Oh, that's neat. There are a few waiting for it. position to make that interception it's come loose over to the left lovely feet whipped in oh no that's not the ball he wanted 
half-time whistle goes. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. How would you review the first half? I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. Spain head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Are the team any further forward than they were when they started out? So we're just settling back into this second half. Spain clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. That is terrific skill. Can he deliver? Plays it out to the wing. Swung in towards the middle. Shapes to shoot! Get that clear. Lofted into the middle. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those breaking passes just to spread the play. Saul. Saul provides an outlet. Repelled by the keeper. And it's Thiago. Rodrigo. Shoots! And here's Morata. Great gallop down the right-hand side. Hoists it high. Turns and goes back. Saul can get it clear. Isco looking cross-field, changing the point of attack. Saul is on the end of some really unwanted attention. Well, he's the quarterback equivalent, so I'm not surprised that he's... Header! I just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Tries to switch the play. It's a promising run he's making on the right. And helps available out wide. A really good feat. So who's he picking out? He's had a shot! Sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Hoists it forward. He's got options out wide. Sergio Ramos tries to clear. So time is nearly up. One final twist, perhaps. Battles to win it back. 90 minutes up, and we will be back for extra time. Yeah, neither side has anything to show for.